Hi, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to recover your Windows product key from a computer that doesn't boot or maybe it's dead. Now the scenario is you've got your Windows CD and you want to install Windows but you don't have the product key and the sticker's not on the case and you can't find it so you need to retrieve that uh, product key so you can actually reformat the system. Well I'm going to show you how to do that with a free piece of software called Heron's Boot CD. Now this used to be crammed with a lot of crack software and stuff like that but nowadays it's packed with a lot of freeware software okay so you can download it from here I'll put the link for the download in the description so I'm going to fire this up now uh, and recover the actual um, product key for it and we'll be doing this in Windows XP but you can also do it in Windows Vista as well and I'll probably make another video to show you how to do it in Windows 7 so this is a Heron's boot CD now I've got the CD in the drive and I've booted to that drive made that bootable so now we can select our option now what I'm going to do is select on mini X Windows XP okay so I'm going to load this up this loads very very quickly so what I'll do is let this load in now we're going to be retrieving it with some software that's already on the CD need to let this fully load up okay nearly there okay right so what we need to do here is click on this little tab down here and then where it says uh, passwords password keys you need to go up to the top where it says product keys my mouse is spazzing out. Okay, so um, I'm going to be using this one at the bottom here. But you can use any of these four here, but I'm going to be using this for this video. Now this is now loaded. What we need to do here is we need to read remote key. That's what I'm going to do. Click on that. Click on my C drive because that's the drive for the dead computer, and then click on the Windows box there that's where the Windows is, click OK and this will now successfully retrieve the key that it needs okay it give you the product ID the PID number and also the Windows version and there you go it's as simple as that now this will work with Windows Vista as well and I'll make another video just to show you how to do it on Windows 7 okay so I hope you enjoy these videos my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk if you enjoy these videos please remember hit the subscribe button show your support guys if you've got any problems with your computer head over to the forums the link's down there on the bottom of the screen and uh, post them up there and I'll do my best to help you okay thanks a lot for watching guys bye for now